Pinatubo is one of the best two-year-olds we've seen for many years. Both he and fellow Group 1 winner Earthlight were foaled here at Kildangenstad, which is also home to their sire Shamadal. We recently visited Godolphin's Irish base to talk to Jimmy Highland and hear about the early days of Pinatubo. Yeah, Shamadal, he's had a, he's had a fantastic year with his two-year-olds and obviously the highlights being Pinatubo and, and Earthlight, both, both homebreds, along with Ickworth, who's trained by Will McCreary locally, um, also obviously a homebred. So it's been a fantastic year um, to have those horses um, you know, raised here and um, on the farms and, and, and to watch their careers then develop. It's amazing, um, Pinatubo was, was, was foaled on Kildangan, um, was here for six months until he was a weanling and then moved to Blackhall Studs and stayed there until he was a summer yearling in July and uh, returned to Kildangan then for his breaking prep and, and was here November last year. So it's amazing that he's now unbeaten in five races and he's raced at 128. When we were doing the mating for Shamardal and Lava Flow, in a way, it was um, it was quite an obvious mating and that's um, Shamardal had already sired two stakes winners out of Dalakani Mirrors prior to Pinatubu. We find and what Shamardal brings, he brings that substance and power. He's a distinctive look when you see him, you know, he's a strong head, deep girted, strong hind quarters, and you're going to be left with the impression that, you know, he uses power and strength and he passes that on to his progeny. And on top of that, then his competitiveness um, as a racehorse. In Pinatubu's case, he was very, very correct. Um, from, from the get-go and thankfully he, he had an uncomplicated development. There was no issues with him health-wise, confirmation-wise and you hear Charlie Appleby sort of referring to his attitude and temperament laid back and relaxed and that's pretty much the way he was here right through his development here. Um, you know, very straightforward horse to deal with, uh, no real health issues, very uncomplicated and just a great temperament and you know, they're all key things you need when you're going to war as a racehorse and, and thankfully he has all those. Very relaxed horse, um, just loves sleeping and eating. He uh, went to the ring and he never gave us an ounce of trouble. He took his saddles, took his rollers, took his saddles easy enough. He was very balanced in the ring dungeon, and but very, very laid back horse. It's brilliant to see him, especially in the car of finishing so well. We just get them used to going in and out of the boxes, get them used to the area. We bring them to the ring then, starting in juice and dungeon in the ring. For six weeks they're here, they change majorly like they, they, they grow and they size up and different and then time we send them away it's what we see in the racetrack is a big difference again. I always say to everybody we're here to educate them you know for the next phase of being a racehorse so the breaking breaking part of the operation here is very important for those young horses that they've got a very good experience with with um, with people and with with the process and and then they're ready to go into training and and um, you know, I suppose the next phase for something like Pinatubu, who's been foaled and raised here, would for, for him to go on and win classics and become the superstar that we hope he's going to be and then retire as a stallion someday, or Earthlight for that, for that matter. So there's lots to look forward to, but that would be the full cycle for the staff and, and uh, I suppose the, the job satisfaction that to produce a horse like that and for him to do the full, full circle and become a champion and then retire as a stallion. Um, I think there's great satisfaction in that and I'm very privileged in my position to be, um, I suppose, leading the team as well, but having that support from the team is fantastic and, and um, our success is their success and, and it's great for, just for the Godolphin team.